happening today on a day like this one. You know, everyone's looking for ways to oh. beat the heat. It is going to be a challenge for people in some places due to a lack of swimming pools. News 8's Ken Houston joining us live in West Haven this morning with some solutions. Good morning, Ken. Good morning, Laura and Keith. Actually, the weather is not bad out here right now, but of course, as Steve just said a moment ago, that's all going to change in a matter of hours. In fact, today, we can expect the temperature to climb back into the 90s, but there are ways to survive the heat wave. In addition to West Haven Beach, Lighthouse Point Park in New Haven is a great way to cool off. Families are known to flock there during this time of year, of course. However, if you're looking to take a dip in New Haven public pools, it's not happening, folks. Out of the five facilities, the school district says Hill House High School will be the only pool open this summer. The reason has to do with maintenance issues. It's unfortunate because it's, you know, a lack of uh, space and opportunity for those kids to be able to actually go out and have fun. And, um, you know, the question is, what else are they going to do this summer um, if those spaces are closed? I really do hope that they can figure out something, some kind of alternative. Maybe surrounding towns can help out. In Waterbury, the story is pretty much the same. Two of its three pools are closed right now due to renovations and repairs, but there are other options to help you survive the heat. And of course, we'll take a look at what they are coming up in our next half hour. We're live in West Haven this morning. Ken Houston, News 8.